Concordia head coach Chris Gould, the GSAC of Women's Soccer Coach of the Year. Coach, first of all, congratulations. First Concordia coach to earn the award. Your women's squad the last couple of years has been known for you guys' great defense, and, and this year you're really good on offense too, winning the first conference title in program history. Now, how has the program transformed in, in your five years to uh, this year with the unprecedented success? Um, I think a lot of it is just kind of bringing in players that fit into our system. And, you know, the, the kids have done an incredible amount of work to get where they're at. And um, a lot of it is due to their selflessness and togetherness on the field. And, you know, it's just uh, it's nice to see a, a plan come to, to fruition, you know, and it's been a lot of hard work within the process. And, um, you know, I'm really happy with how the season has gone so far. All right, the GSAC is, is loaded on the women's side with four top 15 teams. You guys haven't lost a match. You guys came out on top. You know, what was the season like battling with, with teams like that every week? It's great. I mean, it, this is kind of uh, what we really want. We want to be able to contend with some of the top teams in the conference. And, you know, we were lucky enough to, to be performing well in the day and, and maybe got a little bit of luck when we needed it and uh, or have certain players step up when you need it. And that's really what this team's been all about is – you know, different games, different players step up for the team when someone's maybe not playing really well, someone else steps up and gets a goal out of nowhere. And that's been the fun thing to watch is to see some of these players rise up during adversity and really come through for their teammates. All right, you got five all GSAC selections off your team this year, and they're all underclassmen. You know, have you been able to bring in such talented players that are, that are so young? Um, well, I mean, that's just been hard work of the coaching staff, you know, and... Um, really comes down to, to the girls that you're only rewarded get the individual awards if the, if the team is good and um, that's really been down to the team stepping up and you know as much as individuals are being celebrated it really comes down to the team uh, you know performing and, and allowing those players to shine. All right, you guys are heading into the GSAC tournament here as the number one seed. All the games will be as home as far as you guys can go and then getting in the NAA tournament after that if everything goes well. But what are kind of some goals for this team as you guys hit postseason play here? Really, uh, you know, we want to be peaking and, and play well. That's really what it comes down to. If we can execute the way we want to execute, um, you know, this time of year, it's a game-by-game -game thing. So you try not to think too far ahead and, you know, you respect every opponent that you're going to play. And, you know, really we just need to do what we do to the best of our ability. All right, it'll be Friday at 2 p.m. at Eagles Field. We'll find the opponent out uh, after tonight's matches. So I wish you good luck, and we'll talk to you after that game on Friday. Thank